A group of young immigrants known as the Dream Nine remain in an Arizona detention center more than a week after attempting to reenter the United States to protest the Obama administration's record deportations. While most of the Dreamers had previously been deported or compelled to leave the United States because of current policy, three others chose to join them in Mexico and accompany them home. All nine are being held at Alloy Detention Center. Some say they've been placed in solitary confinement after launching a hunger strike and attempting to collect the stories of fellow migrants. Dreamer Lisbeth Mateo spoke in a recording Monday, saying it was her fifth day in solitary. I'm Lisbeth Mateo. I'm at the Evo Detention Center. This is my fifth day for solitary confinement, and um, I want all nine of us to go home as soon as possible. Conditions here are not, are not the best. Um, there are women who have been waiting for months um, to see their asylum officer um, to get an interview. Even three years, they're all waiting. On Monday, Congress member Mike Honda released a letter signed by 33 members of Congress calling on President Obama to release the Dream Nine. Quote, these youth are the victims of our broken immigration policy, and they deserve to come home to the United States, where they can continue to work towards fulfilling their dreams of higher education, his letter read.